what's right and welcome to the second episode of Trading to Inform Elite and Beans. And as you should know if you've watched the first episode, I have to show you all of my deals at once because I can't record for over 10 minutes and even when I pause it, it's still, the, the 10 minutes still carries on going. So here we go. First we've got three Edding Geckos. Um, I bought them over 650 and sold them for 800. I only really picked these up because I made their account, I was mass bidding, they're making about 100 coins on each one. And I picked up about 50. There were only a few left, so I thought I might as well as you pick up the last three that I couldn't quite uh, get with all the coins because I didn't have enough coins. So, yeah, that's about 300 coins worth of there. And then with this for Tongan, I used the Buy It Now Catalyst or Shadow method. So, I'll show you that quickly now. You put 1k. A Mac by now, and then we put it to Catalyst and we search. If you get any good ones, so we might say we are usually in the 59th minute if you're a good one. But this Darren Bent might have been this up for 12 hours, he might be a good deal. So we'll go and search him up. So that might be a good deal because the next cheapest one is 1.6 and this one's 350. I'm not actually going to buy it though um, because this method the players do take quite a while and sometimes you don't really make much profit out of it. So I wouldn't really suggest doing this method. Um, but I'm just showing you that that's how I bought the tongue in. I also use this method to get Draxler because you can also use Shadow. I used it to get Menez and Johnson and I also used it to pick up these two players here who still haven't sold so also we'll carry on going down the line i've got uh, jackson martinez I picked him up using this method we'll just search a striker we'll use him as the example and here we go and then we search him in centre defensive mid and any we just search him in centre defensive mid Two come up, 5.5 and 6, there wasn't really any profit to be made there. And we're searching the centre mid. And there aren't really any uh, good um, profits there, so we'll go up to the centre attacking mid. The cheapest one is 2.4 and there's one here for 1.7 so I guess you could put a bid on it and make 300 coins but I wouldn't and then this trial I used the method in my last video um, where you put it at either Hunter or Catalyst chemistry style and then put the max price at 2000 coins and if you get a player with a bid on add him to the transfer target search at his price and then you just bid on him until you want to. And then our final few players, I am, my hometown is Burnley. And today I watched the Burnley Blackburn game. And Burnley won and Ings scored the winning goal. And it wasn't just any derby, it was 35 years ended. So I knew that his price would shoot up. So I quickly, just before the game ended, bought them all for about 400 coins a between 400 and 800 coins and I sold them all for about one and a half K so now I'll quickly just run through all the player prices it will just be one second so I have to go and get a piece of paper I wrote them down on so one sec right so I'm back guys and I'll just tell you the profits now so I picked up the three jackals as you already know for 650 coins each so we'll just get rid of those and then to the Tongan, I picked him up for 850 coins, so I made about 400 coins on him. And this Jackson Martinez, I picked him up for 2.3k, so I made probably just over 500 coins on him. And this Julian Draxler, I picked him up for 1k, sold him for 1.4, so I've got 350 coins profit. And this Triore was the best deal of the series, I picked him up. 1,900 coins, sold him for 4.6, making something like a three and a half k profit. 
then this Menes I picked him up for 1000 coins so as you use that method that I've said isn't a great one where you put catalyst and then 1000 by now I wouldn't really suggest using that method and then the same with this Johnson I used that method again and then I picked him up for 800 and I could only sell him for 850 then all of these injuries um, I can't remember exactly, one of them was about 400 coins, the rest were about 800 coins. So we'll quickly get rid of all of these. There we go. I picked this chief up for 850 coins and trying to sell him for about 1.9. I'll probably be able to sell him for about 1.5 quite easily. And that will give me about an 800 coin profit. And then this Yadson, uh, this is the dodgy method again um, I picked him up for 1k and he wants off 1.3 so that is a bit weird but we should be able to break even on him and thanks for watching this episode guys and I'll see you later it's good to see that we've made a bit more profit than last episode we made about 3k we started this episode with 5,448 coins now we've got 10k or 10.3k and these two players so we bought them both for a thousand coins, so we put ourselves in 12,356k at least. So thanks for watching, and see you later.